this morning we decided to run to our local craft store again we got a couple more orders for lanterns to make for some friends of ours so while we're at the store we happened to notice there was a car show happening in the same parking lot so walk around with us take a look at some of the cars um brings back a lot of memories from daddy being in the car business all these years and a lot of cars daddy always had over the years never thought we'd see them at a car show one day but here they are so come on walk around with us and see if you see a car that you like
this morning we're on the way to Kim's mama's house. We found out that um, her grandpa, who used to burn tobacco a long time ago, still has a barn with a lot of tobacco sticks in it. Uh, if you don't know, around here, tobacco sticks are getting kind of hard to find. It's been a long time since people have used tobacco sticks to use for cropping tobacco with. So they're getting a little scarce. So we're gonna ride over there this morning and go in uh, Kim's grandpa's old barn and take a look and see how many they've got. Hopefully we can get us a truckload. I know there's a lot of different things you can do with tobacco sticks, different projects you can do. I know um, years ago I made a star and some other things uh, out of tobacco sticks. So if we got tobacco sticks on hand, we can start trying to make a few more projects and kind of bring you along with us to kind of see what we're doing. So let's go over there and climb up in the old barn, see many tobacco sticks they got, see what we're running into. Hopefully no snakes or any critters like that running around today. But it is kind of cool this morning, so hopefully they're all hibernated and or somewhere else besides where we're gonna be. So come on, jump in the barn with us and see what we can find. Welcome back to the Worley Family Homestead. Today I'm gonna to give you another update on the collars. Um, they're growing a whole lot better. Um, you can see how big they are now. He's got to plow them one more time and they've chopped them so that the weeds are clean out of them. So they are really growing, so it won't be long, we'll be cutting collars. Mm-hmm. Bundle, bundle and make you a good leaf and you tie. 
Sometimes when you laid it down, you had to take the board and uh, put on the things. Because mm -hmm. used to, you, I wish we had fish yeah. that day. Yeah. I really would. Yep, yeah, that's a truckload of sticks right there. Yep. Yeah. Well, that was a nice. There's some nice ones in there. <laughs> Might better save that one out, Nee. No, it was a big that one I had thrown out. That oh, I got it over. I put it on the left side so I wouldn't lose it. Oh, that was a big one. Yeah. Make out a walking stick. There's one of them that's a pretty good walking stick. It's already kind of rounded off a little bit. So I don't know. I look at it and see. I got these. Yeah. Yep. I didn't catch him today on film, but he came running up today and he acted fine. So he's good. In the last video, had a couple comments where they thought Emma might have been limping a little bit, and we kind of thought he was too. But uh, we kept out on him the last few days, and uh, I didn't get it when I fed up today. But um, he came up trotting just like he normally does, and uh, he was getting along pretty good today. So uh, thank y'all for keeping an eye on him, help us keep an eye on him. And uh, if y'all see anything like that we need to take care of, you let us know because we may miss it. And it seems like you can see things a little better on the video than you can in person sometimes. So. Uh, we appreciate it. Elmo's doing good. It's almost dark. Him and the girls right here eating a little bit before they go to bed, I guess. But uh, again, we appreciate you joining us. We thank you again. Well, for folks, that. I reckon that wraps it up for this video. But if y'all enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. If you had a favorite car at the car show, just please leave a comment down below which one was your favorite. And again, we appreciate you. We're glad you joined us again this time, and we hope to see you again on the next video.